the lineup for Manchester United. Victor Lindelof plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. Well, there's no getting away from it. This is the man so many people have been focusing on ahead of this particular game. Playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. Really getting stuck in. Bruno Fernandes has it. Moving forward effectively. Is it going to be? And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Romain Perrault. Smallbone. Kral. Regained possession. And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. High pressing and good high pressing. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Bruno Fernandes, the supporters want to see him have a go, in it goes, the goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, as you can see here, Fernandes gets beyond the challenge of the defender, and the strike from Fernandes is absolutely perfect. Pace, power and accuracy, what a player he is. Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. And in the right position to read it. Smallbone. Greenwood United finding space on the wing and possibilities inside the box Casimiro oh big opportunity and a decent save full credit
And he's fired over the corner. Not the best clearance. Armstrong. What a bad pass it was. And he's in. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. Well, Eric Ten Hag looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side has been really good today. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Cruz. Smallbone. Decent looking pass. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Casimiro. On to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. He's driven in the corner. Not away completely. Fernandes. There's the cutback. Opportunity. Well, he had clearly drifted into an offside position. Well, you can see from his reaction, he knew that wouldn't count. And so the first half story has been written half time here at Old Trafford. And they kick off here. So underway again here, the pendulum having already swung United's way. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Carlos Alcaraz. Now do they mean business on this occasion? Cleared away comprehensively. Well, delighted to say, more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Crystal Palace. Now, who can he play it to? Shot attempted, and the keeper throws himself at the ball. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Short corner favoured. And fine goalkeeping. And another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Now sending it in. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. On to Greenwood. Scott McTominay. So a half an hour remaining. Casemiro. Oh, great defending. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action. Will he find the net? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. 
Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So the action underway once more, and it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. And the timing was perfect, ball one. Armstrong. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Playing advantage here, United keep it. Scott McTominay. Well, when you have the lead, you can play in this manner, keeping the ball like this. It's with McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Alcaraz. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Advantage, Manchester United. Ten minutes left for play. Given away again. Now with Greenwood. Making progress. Sends it back. Now just the tackle that was needed. And fed forwards. Well, no real accuracy. And easy for the keeper. We will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Jaden Sancho. Good idea. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, they love him and he loves them. It's great scenes here. Well, as you can see again, Sancho plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders, and then it's a top-class strike from Fernandes. His technique is absolutely spot-on. Just look at the power he generates here. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Bruno Fernandes.